your New York team. We'll have you spawn right next to them. What's the worst that could happen? Um, this right here. This was pretty pretty nutty. And there a kill tag. How's it going everybody? Kevin here once again giving you a different video today. We're doing a cut commentary kind of video over some of the new gameplay that was recently put into the MCC. If you guys don't remember from my last MCC update video, we we're talking about the new 8v8 mayhem playlist that's been added to CE. Basically, it's 8v8 on crazy maps, crazy settings, and just complete, well, mayhem. So if you're gonna jump into some games, guys, show you the experience of what it's like, and if this is something you'll want to try out on the MCC. So I suggest staying throughout the whole video and experiencing the game with me. Okay, so the way to select the Mayhem playlist is that you want to have only Combat Evolve selected for your games. And then over here you want to have Action Sack selected as your game mode. And make sure that's on 8v8 size Big Team Battle Ops size. So you get a chance to play just as Mayhem playlist. So let's jump right in and experience it together. Alright, we're playing Mayhem tonight guys. This is 8v8 Capture the Flag. <laughs> CTF and we're taking our flag into their base, their flag into our base, or their flag into their base, um, something like that. 8v8 Beaver Creek, it's a bit nutty, I like this aggressive flag idea. You don't have to work your way to get, grab their flag and bring it into the base, you just gotta grab the flag and put it in the base, so it does have to work for you, so you just gotta jump in and just do it. Let's try it out here. Flag captured. Wait, how do you, can you juggle in this game? I'll just press Y and then drop the flag. It just automatically picks it up. What the, why am I getting shot? Gotcha, that's our, there we go. We finally got a kill on the game here. All right, let's move out a little bit here. Rotate out, okay. This blue guy didn't even care about killing his teammate. He's like, he saw me, he's like, I see red. And just went off. Wait, is that a sniper rifle down here? I just completely missed, <gasps> sniper rifle. Okay, here we go. Now, if only I could figure out a way to get out of this damn base without dying. Dude, it's way too hot. I can't even go downstairs. It's too hot. What am I supposed to do? Can I go downstairs now without dying horribly? Oh god, nope. No, we can't. No, we can't. <laughs> They're throwing grenades on me, brother. Oh, that. Like crossing the street. You gotta check your lefts, gotta check your rights. I'm on top of there, really? Oh, he's on top of our base. I see him. I see you. Don't act like I don't see you, though, dude. Oh, I get more sniper ammo then. No! No! Dude, what the hell? Get this guy off me. No! Don't throw that grenade! No! Oh! All she and LD50 are on the other team. I know these guys. They're good players. Can I... Can I just... Can I just get out of the base? Can I just... Can I just... Can I... Can I... No, I can't. Did I kill... Uh... I think I killed... You there, dude? Oh! Oh! Jumped right over you, brother. I got those hops like Jordan. This is like, wait, I don't understand this map game mode at all. I'm so lost. Bullshit! Bullshit! Get you move, 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 move. There we go. Oh my God! Let me not move. Okay. Can I check? Check your rights. Check your lefts. Kill the people who jump in front of you. You know, just like it's just like crossing the street. Palshi, that's right, Palshi. That's right, Palshi. You take that. Got you, LD. I got Palshi then LD. Oh my god, I'm a legend. Oh wait, so I think like the flag, whoever's gonna be scoring, it flips around. I think we it flips back and forth between who's gonna score. That's interesting. I like that. All right, now we're the team that needs to push the flag into their base. Okay, I like this. I don't know why they don't have this mode in other Halo games. This is pretty sweet. I really like that idea. 8v8 CTF that we're playing, but the thing is that it's one flag CTF, so it plays just like that. But the thing is that the flag rotates for who's attacking and who's defending like every two minutes or so. So now I think we're on the, we're on the offense now for the next minute. That's what it is, yeah. And so then, the next, and then after the minute goes, then it, flags flip to the other base. And so now, so now they're attacking our base. We're, def we're defenders now, and it swaps back and forth every two minutes, and it's one flag CTF. And all you gotta do is push, grab your, the flag, and put it into their base. You don't need to like 
work your way to capturing the flag. You just gotta bring it to their base. That's why I jump into this this is for computer chaos, and I'm pretty sure it seems like they're providing that exactly how I want it when I come to see. Oh, it's two to one right now. So now we're taking the flag into the base since we're the offensive team now. And as long as that flag is in play, it will continue to be our offense because the clock's run out. I'm gonna follow Doge here. No, I chose wrong. Damn it. It's such a coin flip going through that one. Do you guys have any fond memories of playing CE back in the day? Because this kind of helps me remind me of like what it was like playing capture, playing uh, Combat Evolved back in the days, where it was really just you're playing for just like the hell of it, playing for the fun of it, not trying to be like super competitive about the whole thing, but just kind of jumping in and just having straight up just fun. Like not giving two craps about your score or anything. It's all about just jumping in, and as long as you had fun playing the game, it was a good game. I feel like we kind of lost that experience quite a bit over the years. Of course, my memory is real hazy to how the game truly played back then, because I was such a casual player back then that I never took in consideration of like the details of the game, like how many shots it is to kill somebody with a magnum. I would just keep on firing until they're dead. I didn't know it was fully auto either. I thought it was semi-auto the whole time until the, and the MCC. This game was the game to play back in the day. It was just the fire. It was just, it was the first game to truly get down a dual stick control. Teammate, I'm so sorry. Dude, I can totally explain that. I can totally explain that. Oh God, I'm dead. Like C's multiplayer was really just more for just like a casual blow them up high action experience with a good feel and just cost really solid controls and it was the first shooter on console to really do that player is that a camera guy i just saw no wait is it no it's not why would you throw that grenade okay there's a guy right here that's why totally understandable now i'm not mad at all anymore gator you're a good guy oh no pat stats why would you do that first of all your name should be pad stats not pat stats you don't pat your stats you pad your stats like i'm gonna pat my stats right now good stats hit him with that proper grammar get him with that grammar <laughs> Man, i remember spending countless hours playing ce campaign with my brother just split screening and just trying to play through the game I think we just play on like normal, maybe heroic. I do remember I did beat this game on Legendary when it was like the game to play. And it was after that, I was like hooked. But of course, I'm like, I don't remember ever getting like too frustrated or mad when playing like CE or any other Halo campaigns. I'm <gasps> you ate so many shots right there, Paul She. Okay, there we go. Oh no, <laughs> that was so horribly timed. All right, where are they at? Where are we going? All right. I think it could have just been like back then. I was just like, I, I'm just like playing video games. Like Halo was playing video games for to me back in the day. <laughs> Come on, push it forward. Gotcha, Elder. Dude, this match has been going on for so long. This is a marathon of a match we're playing right now. This is a not only a test of your skill, but your patience as well. Oh, we lost our first game. Big Team Crazy King on Rat Race. Oh boy, this is going to be crazy. I need to like breathe. I need to prepare myself for this because this is going to be just ridiculous. So this is a bit nuts. There we go. Let's let the chaos happen because these spawns on this would uh look at look at these spawns look at these spawns how am i supposed to deal with this <laughs> yeah this entire map when they keep spawning it's just like right there right next to them man like that synchronized death move right there look i spawned right in front of this guy what is this game this is exactly what i was afraid of when it came to mayhem ce the map is big enough but i don't think the spawns are good enough for it <laughs> i spawned you like five times in a row <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay, at least we got out of it this time. Gotcha. Oh, no, 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 no! I got a triple kill! Oh, no, 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 I just, I just got the, I just got a camel, man, let me, let me enjoy it. Okay, here comes some grenade throws, boys. 
Hey, make it happen. Kill tech. There we go. <laughs> Just throw grenades, guys. Ain't coming nowhere near me, brothers. Oh my god, we're only killing three boys. Oh my god, teammates. Please, just stop. No, I'm one of you. I'm one of you now. <laughs> I have no idea if we can pull us back or not. I was gonna just... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That spawn. A bit nutty. I know that the spawns are definitely influenced by where your teammates are. So you sp I don't think there's really like set spawns are trying to balance it out or anything. It's really just like, oh, you're near your team. We'll have you spawn right next to them. What's the worst that could happen? Um, this right here. This was pretty pretty nutty. I never kill tech. That's the one thing I love about these kind of crazy modes too, is that you have stuff like that where you just teams line up and you just throw nades and you get like five kills from just throwing grenades. From everyone just piling up together, you know. That's the idea of this mode. Just have it just be just, just, just total insanity, and let it just be crazy, and then it's just gonna be fun. Ah, uh, no, we lost. All right, so all those clips were actually cut from my live stream. If you guys want to stay up to date whenever I live stream, check out the link in the description down below. It is the very first link to my Twitch channel. That's where I stream quite often. I do MCC and Halo 5 and everything in between. And so if you guys want to keep up with day or want to play with me, that's the best opportunity to jump in and get some games in. But yeah, guys, that's my experience with the MCC Mayhem playlist. I played it all night and it was a lot of fun. It's like controlled chaos where I thought it was just going to be like constant spawn deaths and everything. That is kind of like that derelict. But uh, from the maps I did get a chance to play, uh, I didn't play Longest and I didn't get a chance to play Hang'em High either. But everything else I did get to play and it was fun. It was kind of like ca controlled chaos where like I said, where it's like, it's ridiculous, but if you're a good player and you know how to play CE, and you know the good spots and weapon spawns, you can dominate. You could definitely dominate on this mode and it's actually a lot of fun, constant action and highly suggest you guys jump into it while the game is still new and fresh because I could see the population on this dying off pretty quick uh, but if you guys like playing these chaotic modes uh, then maybe the po population will stick around and hopefully more people get a chance to play because if we're gonna be playing C big TB BTB actually I'll probably be prefer to play this just because of how crazy it is it's a lot of fun highly suggest jumping into the guys so if you guys like these kind of videos please make sure to tap that like button let me know you want to see some more content like this leave a comment down below what your thoughts are on the video where i can improve or what your thoughts are in the mayhem playlist as well if you're new to the channel i want to stay up to date with anything halo related like mcc halo 5 halo infinite everything in between make sure to tap subscribe with the bell to keep you up to date whenever you do anything on this channel if you guys are new or miss any content for me check out the videos on the screen right now i'll catch you on the next video Peace out.